The most important service that all transport layer protocols provide is multiplexing and demultiplexing, which is extending the service of the network layer from delivering packets between hosts to deliver those packets between the processes running on the hosts. Multiplexing is performed by the sender. The sender has multiple sockets that are communicating with different processes across the network. The sender gathers messages to be sent from the source applications from the process sockets. It adds required header information to them and makes transport layer segments and passes the segments to network layer. At the receiver side, transport layer action is to receive the segments from the network layer, examine the fields to identify the receiving socket, and deliver the segment contents to the target socket. This is called demultiplexing. When a host receives an IP datagram in layer 3, which is the network layer, the datagram has IP addresses of the source and destination hosts. That is how datagrams are delivered in layer 3, using IP addresses. The delivered datagram carries one transport layer segment. Transport layer segment has a source port and destination port addresses, and some other fields. Therefore, a process-to-process -process addressing is a combination of host addressing in the network layer datagram and port addressing in the transport layer segment to locate the process. This is similar to sending a packet to a unit in a high-rise building. The building is similar to the host, so IP address is similar to building address. A process is similar to unit, and socket is similar to unit door. So the port number is like providing the unit door address in that building. So using the combination of the IP address and port number, the segment is directed to the appropriate socket and the appropriate process. TCP is connection oriented and UDP is connectionless. What do those words mean in terms of transport layer service of identifying and delivering segments among processes? In connectionless demultiplexing, only destination IP address and destination port number are used for delivering the segments to the processes. In connection-oriented demultiplexing, there is a connection, like a pipe, between the sending and receiving processes. So, there is a need to relate processes at the sending and receiving sites. This is done by processing port number and IP address for source processes in addition to destination processing formation.